Good morning, everybody. Man, oh man. I was expecting something, but I wasn't expecting this for season three. I was expecting the unlimited XP glitch or the weapon glitch or some type of glitch. God mode something. This this is disappointing to wake up to in the morning and see this all across the Google feed here. I don't know what they're doing over there at the Activision. Man, they're just, it's almost like they don't want the game anymore. It's almost like they want to destroy the game. So, this is mainly about DMZ. Well, this is 100% about DMZ. I'm sure if this they keep going about this track, they'll bring it to other game modes. But, we are talking pay to win, guys. Pay to win. In a fucking Call of Duty game. I mean, pardon my language, but... It's, it is what it is. I mean, there's no other way to look at it here. I mean, guys, this is this is crazy. So what we got? We've got okay. Let you know before we even. We had this in Modern Warfare in 2019's Modern Warfare. Okay, we had something like this. You buy skins, you sit in a dark corner. You you know special guns do special things, stuff like that. I remember when the first tracer pack came out for the kilo. That thing was unstoppable for about two weeks. And then they nerfed it. And then the next tracer pack, you know, you just kept buying the tracer packs. You were the dominant person in the lobby. Until you came across someone that had the same exact tracer pack. And then that's when actual skill came into play. I just don't understand what they think they're going to do here. It didn't work then. It's not going to work now. But they're going to make money. And that's what it's about. The green. So, this is all about the new Bomb Squad pack that just released in the store yesterday when the Season 3 dropped. People realized very quickly, I didn't even look at it that much, so honestly, I didn't realize it. But, the only way, as of right now, to unlock the fourth operator slot is to buy this pack. You can't unlock it in game, you can't do it through playing the game, through playing DMZ or any other missions. You have to buy it. That's kind of shitty, guys. You're going to a game mode where you had to work hard for everything you got, and if you slipped up and got killed, or an AI dropped you, or something like that, you lost everything. You're going from that hard, hard grind, okay, to throw us $10 and you can have the best of the best and don't work for it at all. It's almost like if for all you people out there that play Destiny 2, here we go. Here's another one. You're going to take a really good game and destroy it with greed for money. So, the big thing that makes this pay to win is because of the fact that when you start out, okay, for one, if you don't play DMZ, you won't understand this, but when you have an insured weapon and you die, something happens, you drop it on the ground, don't bring it out with you. There's a 60 minute timer on it, which means 60 minutes real life time, you have to wait for that gun to come back so you can have that insured slot again, bring in whatever gun you want. Well, if you buy this pack and you use this specific gun that comes with this pack, this blueprint gun, it's not a 60 minute timer it is a 15 minute timer on top of that for that blueprint gun let me make that very clear just for that blueprint gun now on top of all of that the operator skin that comes with it spawns in with a medium backpack now this isn't a one-time deal, okay? This isn't a consumable, all right? You know, you do it once and that would, honestly, that would make more sense. If they went the consumable route, that would make more sense. More money, more people buying it, you know? Then it's still pay to win, but you're still, it make more sense. No, this is a straight up, every match you enter in with this operator skin on, you got a medium backpack right off the start. Now, it gets better. People have been pissed off. 
is at least about this, voicing their opinions, and come along and some data miners dig into it. And they find out that down the road to season three, there's some other bundles getting released or packs. And my god, we got the same thing but even better. We got operator skins coming in that are gonna have self revives off spawn. Again, not a one time use, folks. This is every game you enter into with this operator, you're gonna come in with a self revive. UAVs coming in with score streaks. This is just gonna ruin the game. Why play a game that requires a little bit of skill, a little bit of grinding? When the person next to you, who doesn't put in any of the grinding or any of the skill, drops a hundred bucks, buys all these packs, and comes in fully loaded and just wipes you out. They're just going to ruin the game, guys. <laughs> I don't know what to say. That's, I mean, that's the video right there. <laughs> Tell me what you guys think in the comments. Let, let me know. I would love to hear what everyone has to say about this topic. I really do. I was watching streamers and they're doing the same thing. I actually think a streamer is the first one that really noticed it that went made it go viral. This is just Yeah, I'm gonna end the video guys. This this is absolutely ridiculous. Thank you for watching and like, like I said, comment please. Let me know what you think. Let me know what your thoughts are on it. Uh, drop me a like, drop me a subscribe if you wanna get some more. Yeah, guys, thank you. I hope you all have a great day.